Hello guys, in this video I will show you how to optimize Fortnite for maximum performance and lowest input delay. Also read this pink and download is in the description. After you download this folder, which have a lot of tweaks, we can start with the 2024 tweaks and yep, this is some older tweaks but this is new tweaks. They are pretty good. And yeah, this is mainly for improving your performance, cleanup. This will uh, delete your temp and logs, but uh, just run it as administrator. But um, I have games saved in temp, so I will don't delete it because I don't want to install my game again. But it uh, really Im improves your performance if you have low disk space. CMD, this is some BCD edit tweaks and disable migrations. If you play Valorant, don't run these tweaks. Disable service script, I really recommend you, you don't run it if you using Microsoft account on your PC and if you really don't know what you're doing because this don't do that much different. So it's for only advanced users, okay. Windows timer not needed. Import important tweaks. This is really good disabling power saving features on USB and internet, which can improve your ping and input delay. Keyboard and mouse optimizations. Here is a lot of tweaks. And lower input delay. This is just lower input delay of your computer. Debug registry. This is everything. Just run it, and it will improve your performance because it's disabling not needed features and optimize as well as host drive tweaks. This is for. HDD and SSD also, so run it if you use both. And now you need to select what you have. I have SSD, so I will use SSD tweak. But if you have HDD, run this. Okay. Game tweaks here. Just I play Fortnite, so I will use this. You can also try if your Fortnite works better on normal priority, and if you set this to free. It will set Fortnite to high priority, which for me is a lot of better. So, yeah. I will switch it to normal and test what's better for you. And the same is for, Val for Valorant. Global tweaks, this is just performance increasing and GPU tweaks. So yes, run this tweaks. Also some UI tweaks, which um, only lowering your performance, mouse tweaks. Um, improving mouse accuracy, response and acceleration. This make um, your mouse more accurate and l lower delay. Ping reduction. This just decreases your ping. Okay, <laughs> my <laughs> OBS. I hope it's still run. Okay. Um, now you can see it disable my background. So I will only use it again. Now we will go to ping reduction. We s end here. So we will use this. This is network editor settings, which I recommend you do manually because I have some other settings. Like I mean, you for example don't must have I don't know this. So yeah, use what you have. Okay. TCP commands and every of this tweak just lower your ping. Power plan, double uh, um, enable this track file and high performance. This will automatically apply this power plan, which improves your performance if you don't have any custom power plan. RAM tweaks here select what r uh, what is your RAM. So task manager performance memory and here is your RAM. If you don't know, eight gigabits and this disable. It will lower here the processes and handles, which is really good. And this is the best from this pack 2500 tweaks. Here is also how to overclock your uh, overclock your monitor and optimize BIOS, which have this make you really, really high performance boost. Also, custom power plan. And here is the 2500 tweaks. Here you need to log in. Yes. 
Okay, I'm in this application. Here we can see what's planned in feature, also what features this app have. We'll go to performance and yes, I recommend you set it. S use my settings. This definitely disable only here. Set it to eight. Apply processor tweaks, power miser tweaks, and this is just everything for increasing your performance. Also, MSI mode and disable USB idle. After this script will exit, it means it's applied. Set it to one, this to one also, and check all this. Go to latency, and this will help us <coughs> lower our latency. So, LMT set to 200, 2500. Also, you don't must use my settings, this settings works good for me. For example, here, um, for example, this value can work better for you, so I really recommend you test with what's best for you, okay? Clock rate, I recommend you set it to maximum, system interval set to 20 or 1, but 1 is lowest in the way. Debug full interval set to 10, 1000, latency priority set to 6. Enable frame max frame latency and yeah just use my settings or test your own I really recommend this is really uh, important don't set too much uh, low value like this because this can they don't must do good things I recommend using like 16 also 16 here and check all these buttons also if you I uncheck it like this it means it will revert all the tweaks from this so if I don't want um, enable lazy mode or I mean this is uh, um, enabled lazy mode like default and this will tweak it so I, I want to revert it revert it okay priority separation here you can say if you want lower latency moderate or performance I want performance so I will set it to performance flux set it to zero this is advanced so I recommend it to test but it do really good results Experimental here are tweaks which this is like recommended must do but this is for really really testing. Here set to 64 ppm size is 100 USB hub size 100 and net power idle 100. Implic text um, for me it don't work good so test if it work for you. I recommend it check everything and here sample size 0 is also set it to 0 text contrast 6 gamma level maximum clear type level 100 multi hop sets recommend using 15 and this on maximum also here set 4 5 6 and 7. If you want to uh, move it like this, only by one by one, I rec just click uh, arrows, okay, on keyboard. 7. And enable this. This is for NVIDIA. If you have AMD, it will don't work for you. And now here is the 2500 tweaks. This will disable telemetry, optimize performance, reduce ping, fix delay, reduce status, and optimize our priority. Priority tweak. This is game mode, so after you run your game, just enable this and here write 500 or test the value, okay? The more value you use, it will lower the memory of applications and it will make your game run a lot of smoother and on more FPS. Here is the another tweaks, where is the guide, how to use it. And that's all from this video, download this in the description. Bye.